Alright guys, what is up? Gimzilla coming back to you with another Hearthstone match point. The show where I display my 11 and X runs in an attempt to show you what works in Arena, what doesn't work in Arena, what's going to get you there, what won't. So this week, coming at you, Mage for the 14th time. 15th maybe, not sure, but she has appeared. Jaina has appeared on match point quite a lot for us, so... Not that I'm I'm salty about it. I'm, I'm I thank Jaina. Thank you for coming out. Thanks for uh, bringing your all this week. We have an aggro mage. Tons and tons and tons of two drops, three drops, decent mediocre four drops, and just a sprinkle, a splash of that late game. We got the boulder fist as always. Single flame strike, Ravenhold assassin, and two fireballs that we use as finishers. Most of our gameplay though, it, it's happening up here. It's in the early game. We got mad scientist as a Epic 2-drop, absolutely insane when played on 2. Plays into Mere Entity and Duplicate as my only two secrets. Other notable all-stars, Double Unstable Portal. It's pulled me a couple legendaries, a couple random 3-mana 4-7s, which, you know, you really can't complain about. And other notable all-stars, really nothing. I mean, I guess Defender of Argus, because I have an early game aggro deck, so... I've been actually casting him on 4 and just using him for the double pump, and continuing face and basically our game plan is play a ton of two drops three drops go face 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 and they're at like 12 health and before they can even react we have like a single fireball or a ravenhold assassin to just cream into them for the victory guys so aggro rush mage with double unstable portal for flare hope you guys enjoy make sure you guys comment leave a like down below I know you're probably sick of seeing Mage, but I just can't help it, guys. It's in my blood to play Mage. It was my first class I've played in Hearthstone, so... I really perfected the class. It reminded me the most of Magic, so... Alright, and... Worgen Infiltrator making an appearance as a wonderful turn one drop. Stealth letting it trade effectively when it wants to on his own terms. So this is a mere entity, guaranteed because I have duplicate in my hand. Two mana mere entity plus a body. Sounds pretty nice to me. I think this will be a good turn for an unstable portal. There you go. That is why you cast your draw cards, guys. <clears throat> that's a little unfortunate for us, but that's fine. Nothing we can't play around here. About to see a pretty powerful recombobulator play right here. Onto a weak four mana minion, upgrade that into a Yeti or something uh, top notch. Sounds pretty good to me. I've often been comboing my Recombobulator with my Keys and Mystic and some of my weaker 4 drops within the deck. This is a turn where I'm just going to go face. There's no reason for me to trade. He's way behind on board. He's obviously going to send this into one of these three health minions. I don't know why I would do it for him. I think instead I'm going to just take the opportunity to do this. Because he's going to choose the highest threat target and kill that. 
Remember, kill for loss. And the golds will get two of the highest threat targets to him, so whatever he deems the highest threat. I think I misplayed that. I think I definitely should have done the keys in Mystic. Not because he had that, obviously, but... Just because when am I ever going to see another... Secret. I'm not sure if I will. I like all these Divine Shields. I guess... <clears throat> Scarlet Crusader's kind of been an all-star in the deck, just because she, she's a sticky minion on three that has a pretty nice attack that chews through minions pretty quick, or chews through heroes' health pool pretty quick. So that's a pretty good pull for him if he has... Flame strike here. Like if he has flame strike here, I think I lose the game. And I think he has it. Wow. That was really close. Alright, I don't really know how to play this. <laughs> I think I just trade off this board. And I'll start fresh. I don't even need the fourth minion. play around mind control tech that's like blown me out one too many games so he does that and takes a 50 50 on a bomber misses oh man he had another secret guys this is it this is where we win the light does not thank you what do you think and a perfect blast mage Oh yes. oh yes. So flame strike still kind of screws us, but that play was totally worth it. Forget about it. We have mirror entity up. There you go. Say no more. No flame strike. No win. All right. Twelve win mage Jaina coming through. Just leave it to that. Keys and Mystic is actually a great freaking rare. I played so many mages on that climb. And she only stole like maybe three secrets, but when you steal a secret, it's just like, I don't know. I can't think of a more demoralizing event. <laughs> All right, here we go. Boom, 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 boom. Oh yeah, that's not bad, guys. That's like, what, 330, 335 gold, plus a golden card and a pack? All right, that's what I'm talking about, guys. Congrats on the 12 win. Thanks for checking it out, guys. Make sure you hit that like and subscribe button and tune in for more future match points and arena hearthstone content guys it's your boy yimzilla signing off